All right, what's up everybody? So today I have here a brand new video. Um, first time I recorded this, the uh, audio didn't record, so now I'm trying this again. I'm even having issues recording this thing all morning. But basically this tutorial video is gonna be how to change your built-in microphone from your iMac or your Windows or whatever to the USB microphone that you have right here. I have the Blue Yeti microphone. This is a fairly easy thing to do in Audition. Uh, just go into audio hardware. And then once you're in the audio hardware, you're going to click um, the microphone that you want to use. But some people like myself, when we first started out using Adobe Audition, didn't know how to do that. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to do this. This is for CS6, but I'm sure this works across the board for CC and all the other later versions that come out. So I hope this guys helps you all out um, in the future when you're doing your own audio recordings in Adobe Audition. Uh, Adobe Audition is really good for doing things like voiceovers, commentaries, things like that. Um, I use it all the time for like my gaming commentaries and stuff like that. So it's really helpful when you're going to uh, be doing that to have really good sounding audio. So this is how you do it. So first things first, you want to boot up Audition. And once it's booted up, you're going to want to go into the different settings and change it. Um, we're going to create a multi-track session. So you just want to go to File, New, Multi-Track Session. And then once you have your multi-track session uh, set up, which is pretty simple, and explanatory, you want to go to File, New, and then we're going to go to Audio File, and that's going to bring up a waveform, and we're just going to call this uh, Test, just because it, we're testing it out. Um, then we're going to want to go to Audio, Preferences, and we're going to go to Audio Hardware. And then right now I have my Yeti stereo microphone selected. Obviously you can use the built-in microphone um, from your webcam microphone if you want to record using that. Um, I don't recommend it just because the audio doesn't sound too great when you're recording with a web camera. The Yeti is probably the better one that you're going to use. Or you can use the built-in uh, microphone from your computer, which also doesn't sound good. So we're going to leave it at the Yeti stereo microphone. It might say Blue uh, Yeti or Blue Snowball or whatever. Just select whatever USB microphone that you have. And then once you do that, you're going to want to hit OK. All right, and then once we're ready, we're going to do uh, we're going to hit record. So we're going to test this out a little bit. I might do a little bit of an intro just to show you guys how it sounds and everything and play it back for you. So let's do something like this. Welcome everybody, we are doing an audio test for the Blue Yeti microphone. This is a short little test on how to switch between the built-in microphone in your iMac as well as the microphone in your USB that you're using. Hope you guys enjoy this. And boom. And voila. Move it back to the uh, time that you started the recording. Welcome everybody. Holy shit, that was a little bit loud. Uh, so I'm gonna move. everybody, we are doing yeah. an audio test for the Blue Yeti microphone. This is a short little test on how to switch between the built-in microphone in your iMac as well as the microphone in your USB that you're using. Hope you guys enjoy this. Yeah, so that's basically the long and short of how to do that in Adobe Audition. It's a relatively simple and easy way of doing that. Um, not too tricky. Just go to Audition. And then you want to go to uh, System Preferences and go to Audio Hardware after you've created the multi-track session everything and you just should start recording through your USB microphone. If you have some issues, you might have to go through system preferences and switch it up or change the microphone USB port. But other than that, you shouldn't have too many problems. So hope you guys learned something uh, with this new uh, tutorial that I did for you guys and it helped you guys out. When I first was starting to try and learn how to use Audition, I didn't know how to set up everything. And this just makes things a little bit easier, especially when you're doing things like commentary videos or gameplay commentary or just recording good gameplay this is the microphone that you're going to want to have in your audition and synced up and everything so hope this helped you guys out and as always guys if you like this please rate comment subscribe i'll see you guys in the next video peace out